Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the 40-year service of the Data.io 29B chip programmer. Um, we ended up with a screw left over. That screw goes to the fan on the factory loud fan. There's a little recess right there. So the head of the screw can go in there. On the AC Infinity fan, there is no little recess there. So, uh, I think I'm going to look for a different fan. Because um, this fan, if you look at the flow, it's backwards. And I've already taken one of these fans apart. You can actually pull the little clip out and tear this fan all apart and go through them. Uh, that's what I did on the loud one that uh, came in DOA. Um, but these are really loud. I might put this these back in. Um, but these are kind of quietish. Yeah. Well, you'll hear in a minute. Because I have it installed right there. It's, it's really smooth. Okay, right, um, standard operating procedure for powering these up without a pack in it is you have. Let me see if I can zoom in here. Probably not. Uh, I'll just tilt it. You have test point two. And test point three. Where is my pink poker? Okay. We have test point two, test point three. And if you jumper those, it will power up without a pack. So we have Mr. Yellow. And we will go test point one or test point three. Point two. This is the rebuilt filter board. We have new cat, new electrolytics on the motherboard and in the vacuum fluorescent display board. Uh, let's grab some power, and we will have the moment of truth. Is this thing gonna like clean power? Um, I'm I'm still curious. I want to test these. Um, I will. I will once I get all three units done i'll put them in bags and i will come back and i will test them with the esr meter um, i can't test the larger ones for leakage because i don't have that i still want a sincor meter but uh they want way too much for them, like two grand um not gonna pay that okay ready no bang that's a good sign. We have a self-test. The 64K. This I chose this one because it boots really quick compared to the one meg. But this will be one meg with the aftermarket memory module. And it's in remote mode. I think uh, this... 40 year service of this Data I 29B was successful. Um, now, in another video, we have the acceptance test procedures for the 29B. This will let us verify and check all the voltages and calibration. We're to check all the voltages at. We're going to check all those. Um, that'll require a whole new video. It's like midnight here. Um, here's schematics. Mutual non-disclosure agreement. Oh, that don't belong on video. But Okay, um, we'll catch y'all later.